Hey, what's up, y'all? Uh, right now, I'm pretty much in my car. Um, to let y'all know, it's not the first time I've been in my car. Um, before I actually stayed up in a boy's crib, I was living in my car for about three weeks because uh, I went through a divorce. Had to be forced out the apartment. Because I had to take myself off the lease because I lost my job. Job stole money from me. Tried to keep me off some contracts that got bought. To where I'm still trying to fight for that stuff too to get my money back because the guy never ever responded to me saying anything about the rest of the money that's supposed to be coming to me. But yeah, like I said, divorced. Lost my job, lost the apartment, so I was living in the car for about three weeks until my boy's parents were actually able enough to, you know, help me out and let me stay with them for a few months. Uh, I'm grateful for them for everything they've done for me, but... I was, you know, basically got put into a toxic environment. You know, I was warned before, but I didn't think it was the way it was. Now, if somebody decided to disrespect me, then expect me to still say hi to them. Even though I brought it to their attention and they're still telling me that they're not going to apologize for what they said or did. I got a problem with that. I got to remove myself from the situation. There's a lot of stuff going on, going on at the place I was staying at. Too many fights. Too many arguments. People cussing at each other. I couldn't do it. That's not my type of and that's that's not my type of vibe. I'm, I'm not used to that. I'm not used to people disrespecting themselves, especially the family members disrespecting each other. I'm not used to that. I had to remove myself, and now, I, as you can see, it's not the best, but. I'm basically in my car. See the suitcase. This ain't no, it's not no stunt. It's not no skit. I'm literally living in my car right now. So for the next few days, I'm going to be, you know, documenting everything. Just giving you guys the real what I'm going through right now. Straight up. This is not no sympathy thing. This is not no, I mean, I don't even know what to say. Cause I'm just, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm doing the best I can, but I'm just tired. Trying to find a new job. During the time I was unemployed, couldn't get nothing. Luckily, I was able to get an offer back with the team, which I'm definitely going to do. I have no choice but to take it right now because... I got this shit going on. I'm at the end of the day, man, just pray for me. Like I said, I'm going to be documenting this stuff for the rest of the time being, time being for the next two weeks. So you are going to see a new update almost every single day. So stay tuned.